Yes, Pia. Heritage Park is the only premier memorial park in the Philippines located at the heart of Metro Manila. And of course, because of this location, it's a very prime location. And also coming in here, I couldn't help but marvel at how the interiors of the lobby was done. Can you tell me about, I could notice there are bamboos in the ceiling of the lobby. Heritage Park was designed and developed with a strong link to our Filipino culture. Pia, our chapels are divided into two sides, one being the terrace wing and also the garden wing. Let us now proceed to one of our premier chapels to show you. So we are now here at the Premier Chapel. It looks very elegant. Welcome to the Premier Chapel of Heritage Park. If you notice, this is our viewing chapel. We divide it into two sections. This is the viewing area, and this is our lounge set. The viewing chapel, if you've noticed, has a lot of Filipino touches in the design. We have our mother of pearl wall, which is the center of the chapel, and we have also mother of pearl lamps in the walls. We have all this to be able to give our customers a nice feel, homey feel, when they're here grieving for their loved ones. And it's very spacious. How many people could you accommodate at a time? The Premier Chapel can seat about 100 to 120 people. And how about for the family? Because most of the time they would be here 24 hours during the duration of the week. Um, what accommodations or what are the different provisions that you have for the family? Oh, for that, Pia, let me show you our family room, which caters to the comfort of our clients. Pia, welcome to the family room of the Premier Chapel. We have, of course, our kitchenette where the family can prepare their meals and a small dining room where they can be able to sit down and enjoy their meals. We also have their restroom where they can take a shower and be able to be comfortable during their whole stay here at Heritage Park. It's like you really thought about how to give family complete comfort. It's like they have their small condominium where they could have a little bit of rest during the time of grieving. Absolutely. Pia, let us now go into the bedroom. Pia, this is now the bedroom of the family in the Premier Chapel. We have all the comforts of life here. We have, of course, our TV set, which has cable. We have a bed that opens up. It's a trundle bed. And then we have a clothes hanger where they can be at home for their duration of their stay here. It's a very comfortable with soft lighting, very, very conducive to their rest here. You really thought about how to make the stay of the family very comfortable. It looks very cozy and it helps you just get a little bit of rest after, you know, a long day of really entertaining people and of course grieving for your loved ones. Absolutely. That is our primary goal for each of our customers that stay with us, for our clients. We just want them to be comfortable. You also have smaller chapels for more intimate gatherings. Yes, Pia. Welcome to the regular chapel of Heritage Park. This chapel can seat about 40 to 50 people at the same time. Now, if you notice, we have dividers on either sides, which can be collapsed. So if a client has a requirement for bigger chapels, then we open these dividers and easily it can accommodate about 150 to even 200 because we have four chapels that we can open up. Wow, so you could really have those for more people to really gather and be with you for your really departed. But for those who want this standard room, how many could you accommodate here? Oh, about 40 to 50 in a standard room. This standard room also has the same features as a premier chapel. We also have our family room, which has a kitchenette, and also their bedroom, which has a restroom as well. Can you tell me more about the crematorium? Pia, yeah, welcome to the crematorium of the Heritage Park. As you see, this is our viewing chapel. This is where we have our final send-off for the dearly beloved. Uh, this is now our crematory chamber, which is lit with an onyx white stone. We have two chambers for the cremation, which makes us very efficient when it comes to having schedules for our cremations. I really noticed when you mentioned the white onyx walls, it really gives that feeling of peacefulness and solitude. And it really adds to that ambiance when we're really saying your final goodbyes. And I also noticed that there are curtains here. Can you tell me more about that? The curtains in our dividing doors are usually drawn when the family member is already put on the conveyor. We don't want the family members to have any memory but sweet memories of their dearly departed. So it's all a lasting memory of happiness and joy. Just like the interior of this room, you see that we have nice, lively colors. So it's just something to lift your spirit. Though it's, there's a, something very sad about what's happening, we still want to give them a very happy ending. That's very thoughtful and that's really something that I'm sure all the families would appreciate.